Hey guys, good morning. It's Matt with Stud Sportsman. I'm um, doing a little something different today. I'm doing an unboxing, but it is not LTV or MTV. What we have here is a tackle warehouse unboxing. And I haven't opened it, but I already know what's inside. That's part of the fun. Uh, actually getting a box of stuff that you actually need and you actually want. So uh, we're going to try this out and uh, see how it goes. Stick around. Alright guys, we're back. I'm um, going to dive right into this thing. Um, this is roughly about a $50 box I got here. Um, Scott, my cousin from Stout Sportsman, he, uh, he sent me a $50 gift certificate for my birthday, which was uh, uh, just over a week ago. So I put my order in and you guys probably already know what, what some of the stuff in this box is going to be. But you know what I like and don't like. Okay, there's my packing list, a return slip, which I probably won't need. Um, I'm going to actually just, I'm going to go down the line with the uh, packing list actually, just to keep it uniform. Uh, first up is Big Bite Baits, Stick Worm, Green Pumpkin Pearl, four and a half inches. Um, it's going to be these here. Usually not a, a color that I, I would normally go with, but... Um, I'm going to try something a little different, you know, just something with a little bit of that, you know, that pearl, that white in there. Uh, maybe be a little bit more appetizing to uh, some of the smallies uh, that we have down here. But uh, definitely like these Big Bite Baits. They're cheap, very cheap, and uh, they're actually effective. Uh, next up, Big Bite Baits Trick Stick. This is the Tilapia 5-inch. Now, I, I actually really like these ones, and I bought a 25-pack. It's the Pro Pack. You'll see right here. And there's just a whole lot of them in there, for lack of a better term. Um, yep, 5-inch trick stick tilapia. Now the tilapia has a, um, it's kind of like a blue and a reddish flake in there. So that's kind of, I'm a big fan of red flake, huge fan. But uh, these have worked so far for me. And, um, you know, I've gotten a, a pack of these, like a, a smaller pack. And I just wanted something bigger because I'm going to go through them and I'm going to use them. Um, next up is the Gary Yamamoto 5-inch Senko, uh, smoked with black, blue, and gold. Um, I wanted to try a little something different uh, with the next Yamamoto's I get. So um, I think these ones here are going to be pretty cool. Um, check out the flake and stuff in there. I don't know if you can hear my cell phone going off in the background. It's vibrating up a storm. But uh, anyway, yep. Um, smoke with black, blue, and um, uh, chartreuse maybe? I don't know. Whatever. They're pretty cool looking though. But uh, these are definitely going to catch fish for me. And uh, these Yamamoto baits is... If I had to go fishing with one bait, uh, bass fishing, just one, it's going to be Yamasenko's for sure. Um, next, we have the Yuzuri 3DB Vibe Prison IU. Now this is going to be a lipless crankbait. Yes. <laughs> Why wouldn't it be, right? Check out this little cute guy here. Huge fan of lipless. Now I actually got a couple of the Yuzuri 3D, uh, 3DB um, lipped crankbaits. But I actually wanted to uh, check them out in the lipless, so I'm kind of excited to uh, to get and throw this. And I have these things packaged quite well. There we go. I believe it's just a half ounce, not not anything huge, but uh, it's got some really cool colors. That prism effect, yeah, moderate moderate rattle to it. But uh, I really like their stuff. He's already got some cool stuff, so I wanted to give that a try. And Scott's buying. Well, why not try some stuff that you don't, you know, stuff that you're going to use, but normally wouldn't buy yourself. 
All right, uh, next, it's another uh, lipless crankbait. It's the Berkeley War Pig. It's the Bleeding Shiner, half ounce. Now you can see the uh, bleeding belly there. This is really cool because I know what's in this box and it's awesome to open it up because it's exactly what I wanted. Just uh, This is actually my first uh, Berkeley War Pig lipless crankbait. I don't have any. Now I do. Hopefully, um, hopefully I'll get some fish on this and get some more. Like I need any more lipless crankbaits, but uh, I like them. I sure do. Got a good rattle. Real heavy, real heavy knock to it. It's good. Lunker hunt. Uh, Lunker frog. Texas toad. I've noticed down here, um, throwing down in uh, Presque Isle here, down in Erie, that um, there's a lot of places to throw uh, top water, um, especially frogs. <coughs> and the only real good bites that I've had have been on, uh, on like the darker frogs, like black or like a dark blue. So I uh, just went ahead and, and got the, this Texas toad. It's got the black underbelly, you know, red eyes, and it's just pretty much just straight black. So uh, hopefully this will. Hopefully this will get a couple of fish because I've still yet to actually land a bass or any fish for that matter on a frog. I've had a bunch of hits and bites, but I just haven't been able to, uh, to lock it up yet. Um, Snatch 70X Baby Bluegill. Now this is from Sixth Sense. Um, one of my earlier videos. Oh, that's probably playing havoc with the microphone right there. Uh, one of my earlier, I think it was an MTV box, I got a Sixth Sense um, lipless crankbait. It was a huge one. It was either seven, I think it was seven eighths of an ounce, but it was, uh, it was pretty mammoth, and I like it. And uh, this is the baby bluegill, and this is exactly what I wanted. It's got the nice green with the uh, with the line stripes, tiny bit of a uh, bleeding mouth there. Just perfect. Perfect little, little bait, decent rattle, happy. It's exactly what I want. It's so nice to open up a box and get everything that you wanted, and not open up the box and be like, "I'm never going to use this. I'm not going to use that." You know, is this even for bass or is this for walleye, really? So, uh, two more things we got going: uh, tungsten uh, skinny drop shot weights, three sixteenths of an ounce, a four pack. On these here. Um, Scott and I were fishing Cayuga Lake up in the New York Finger Lake region uh, last weekend and uh, there was quite a few pike there so we had quite a few um, break-offs and I lost almost all of my drop shot weights but uh, it was totally worth it caught a ton of fish and um, so I needed to uh, replenish it was just just so happened that I had ordered some um, some drop shot weights uh, these are a little heavier than I normally like to throw but uh, getting a little bit deeper into summer, vegetation and the weeds are a little thicker, so I wanted something just a little heavier to uh, to get down in there. And uh, the very last thing in the box, uh, uh oh, hmm, I thought there was. Are they hiding? Uh oh, there's supposed to be something else in here, but there's not. Um, anyway. Uh, Swagger casting pencil weights. These are also three sixteenths of an ounce, and uh, a three pack here. And these come all the way down to three sixty fourths of an ounce, up to a half an ounce. So that's good to keep in mind because a lot of the time uh, I would really like to use a very very light uh, drop shot weight. Um, what I'm kind of curious about there was a uh, there was a couple other things in here that I thought I had put on here. But apparently, I didn't. So I'm gonna have to go ahead and order those because uh, there were some pretty cool uh, drop shot hooks. Um, I think they're called the Trapper. Uh, it's kind of got like a double 90 degree bend at the bottom, so it's, it's I guess set up a little bit better for more of a bait holder. But uh, I was super excited to get those, and now that I look at my uh, order, my invoice sheet, that I didn't get them. So we're gonna have to put in another order. So that I means we're going to have to do another unboxing. But uh, anyways, 
I'm excited. It's like $50 or $55 in baits here. Um, just kind of go over some of these guys again with you. Lipless crankbaits, 100% yes. These things catch fish all day, every day. I'm not so sure about this, but at least it's black and I've got a better chance now. Uh, got our weights. Got to have weight. And we also have mad, mad worms, crazy worms. Big fat 25 pack. So that's what you're getting. That's what you're getting for 50 bucks. And it's all cool stuff that I wanted. Um, probably not going to go back to LTB or MTB anytime soon. It's just a lot of the same crap over and over. And it's just filling up my plastics uh, bin with stuff that I'm never going to use. But uh, thanks for watching. Uh, hit the like button. Subscribe. Uh, tell some friends, family about us. And, uh, you know, go out there and catch some fish. All right. This is Matt Stott Sportsman. I'm out.